Well, today we're at the Etal Mechanica, and Alberto is going to show us a little bit of how to let in a fender here. He's got his Porsche just about ready to go, but we do need to uh, get some lead in here to fill in some of these little divots and what have you. And he's going to kind of explain this as we go along here. Okay, the first thing you do is you clean up the surface, uh, you know, absent from or oxidation, because this is going to, the lead is going to have to stick to the metal. So this is uh, called lead work, but it really is a soft soldering. That's what, uh, in the old days, that's what it used to be called. Now, you can do that with the, um, with the Scotch-Brite wheel. <laughs> And clean. Now we're going to put some uh, flux paste, which is uh, based on a thin, um, thin paste and flux. Uh, when we we'll heat it up, that will clean up the metal, the remaining metal, and uh, it will prepare the surface with the tin. So we're going to be we put a little bit. Just it's called in lingo they call it body butter. What that means, I don't know. Okay, it's pretty well spread now. Okay. You have to uh, remember that most people that do body work uh, use Bondo. Uh, it's to, a bad uh, word around here. Yeah, it's a bad word around here. They only do lead work around here, and that's an art that's uh, being lost, unfortunately, day by day, because everybody wants to use Bondo. It's easy, <laughs> but uh, this becomes structural. This, there's no way it's going to come undone. Uh, once you've got the general shape, as long as you're open on the back that you can reach, you can straighten out the panel. But in some area where you cannot, you can use slightly, you can use a little bit of lead. Here we go. We a, very, a very soft flame. I use a propane torch. And uh, you don't want to, you can use also the access center, but it's a lot more intense. what we call tinning. Huh? It's also what we call tinning. Tinning. It's okay, so now we're gonna maintain the two the two pieces you know warm. And the weather we're using here is a 7030 mix. Yes. You wanna you, you don't wanna use it with much more than that because Side on one side and a smooth 
side and on the other. It's very good because if you can, uh, with the core side, you can actually move it around. pretty low. Now we let it cool down and then we can file it. The good thing about the lead work is that it becomes structure part of the car and uh, in that way if, if you need to add some you can still do that but uh, you can file it and immediately basically prime it and uh, where with Bondo you have to wait for it to dry, put some more, dry, put some more and then you have to soak it with some sort of primer because the bomb though is kind of spongy and therefore very porous therefore it will have to suck some of the paint and lead instead is eternal it, once it's done, it's done thank you <laughs> alright well thanks Alberto for showing us this uh, for you guys out there that want to do some lead work on your car at least now you have kind of a little bit of a primer on how to do it John Acosta Mesa R&D, we'll see you soon.